All right, pretty decent Delpha matchup. Dells, Dells first match. Then they're, they're not too clever, really. A thousand TV Dells, in my opinion. Um, haven't got a lot going for them. So, right. Yeah, Moradam. Yeah, I, I would like it to be good, but um, it really doesn't look like it to me. Uh, two zero two in the Welsh. Yeah, I've dropped. I've dropped Flicky Flack. I've dropped from the Welsh Open now. <laughs> Was it you, Flicky Flack, that you thought a thousand TV Dark Elves were quite good? I think they're quite bad. So it'll be interesting. I think obviously they're better if someone's good. But um, in general, I find them to be underwhelming at a thousand. Like not terrible or anything, not as bad as chaos, but <laughs> and obviously far better than like high elves and pro elves because they've got some block, haven't they, which is useful. But I think two rerolls and not having any dodge really is not too much block. I think they're a bit weak, no mighty blow or anything. Obviously they can roll dice. If they make all the two plus dodges, they're pretty good. No strength. I don't know, I really don't think they're that great, a thousand TV team. That was you. Well hopefully this will be a great advert. For how they're not so good. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed I don't just lose 4-0. <laughs> oh, I mean the good thing the good thing about Necromunda is that we've had years to uh, adjust our expectations, haven't we? Like it was pretty clear the way that it just died off and it wasn't mentioned for so long that it was gonna be underwhelming, I thought. I thought it's pretty much pretty much a given that it wasn't gonna be great. But yeah, I could always hope that it was gonna be alright. So I feel like they should have just made it like an FPS or a or like XCOM. Why not just make it like XCOM? You don't have to reinvent the wheel, do you? Like everyone likes XCOM. Or make it like XCOM in the what they I think if the if the what they could have done <laughs> was make if they really wanted to have five men as the number in a gang which already seems kind of stupid but if that's what they wanted then uh make them spirers because it ain't necromunda necromunda isn't isn't a five man game like that's just not necromunda in any way shape or form it's so it's so stupid because that's not necromunda <laughs> That was my biggest problem with it. It's simply not Necromunda. It could be easier. Yeah, it's stupid, isn't it? So they should have made it... They should have made it... Uh, should have made it Spiras, I think. And then the, then the single player could have been Spiras versus House Gangs. I come back after a long break, second game, it's versus you. Yay! <laughs> that's that's kind of nice, isn't it? I think I think it was meant to be nice. <laughs> Get here, cocky. Oh god. <laughs> well, that's okay. Good job we've got two back to pick up the ball. Oh, got the push. What a beautiful 
beautiful crop kit. It's just like watching the JFW. Hello Jim, love your stuff. Keep yourself sun. Oh, thank you very much, toi Langer. <laughs> oui, oui, oui. <laughs> hey. Glorious, thank you very much for the bit. <laughs> It's a nice, that's a nice removal, isn't it? Stuns on these guys, so we can uh, defend a bit up here. Oh, you fucking dick. Okay, good job I got the movement left. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure he meant like yeah, and I'm sure it's not. I'm sure it's meant nicely. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, like Necromunda. Necromunda is like big gangs, isn't it? Five men is not a Necromunda gang. It's just weird. And like, also, I, w I watched some of the matches of Necromunda, right? And they're shooting people with like heavy stubbers, and they're shooting them about five times and taking off like a third of their health. And it's like, what the hell is this? You know, because they've got to, because they've got five aside, right? So it's it's just stupid because they're like. They're tanking damage like they were bloody uh, space marines, which is just nonsense, isn't it? You can't have that. What can we do? We can keep the ball safe, number one. Keeping the ball safe. Oh god, my connection's interrupted. This has never happened before. Whoa. Okay, I'm st that's still coming up there. Am I still alive? It must be. That wouldn't have come up there, right? Whoa. It sadly looks exactly as bad as I expected. Coffee Monster. Oh, well, I'm, I'm not. I'm, my connection isn't interrupted. My connection is not interrupted, is it? Clearly, because I'm streaming. <laughs> so. What's going on here? This is literally 0% effort, isn't it? <laughs> so weird, isn't it? Hello, Frosty. Maybe I should quit. Oh, it's happened just now in your game. Oh, okay, so. Despite it's on my turn. Probably in it, probably cyanide. Okay, we're all right. We're all right. Phew. <laughs> Name is mine, Jane, though. All right. Can I get? Can I get an extra hit? I could put two players on there and then blitz him and then get an extra hit. That's a lot of work, though. But maybe it's better to try the three plus dodge up. I don't really want to. One, two, three, four, five. I can't even get in there anyway. What do you do, Jim? 
Killing shit very well. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Maybe that's what we need. Get in there with some cheeky wandies. Make it think we're using dwarves. Both down on no balls. No. <laughs> Safe moves first. Put him there. No, I want to get the warriors out in front. <laughs> yeah, I thought got to use uh, got to use chaos and blood bowl too, right? It's like the last chance, the last chance for uh, for hot claw pom action in blood bowl anywhere, anywhere on earth. This is it <laughs> because fumbles already got blood bowl twenty sixteen. And it's going to move to Blood Bowl 2020 as soon as it can. And obviously Blood Bowl 3 is going to be Blood Bowl 2020. So this is our last chance for Clawpa. Hello Sol, yep, just started at this kind of stupid time of like 10 o'clock at night for me. Alright, cheers pretty fast. Oh, the dirty Dino will one day. I thought he was going to blitz with a witch elf then. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, obviously it might be a while for, for it to come out, but still. <coughs> Blood Bowl 3 is still the last chance for... Uh, for... Hot claw palm action. Thanks, so. all. <laughs> Red 
J'aime bien ajouter des bruitages à moi. <rire> Classic, classic bolt down on all balls. Haven't really got very far forward, but I like having the three warriors up front there. So hopefully you can get forward. Now, four turns to get forward with three rerolls. Should be able to do it. Funnily enough, trapping this guy in here has made it a little bit trickier, hasn't it? Yeah, the ogre, the ogre warrior is certainly interesting. Obviously, troll. Troll could you could have a troll more easily in the starting lineup. Um, so like you know, two rerolls and a troll. You could definitely start two rerolls, troll and four warriors, couldn't you? Um, and then as the season progressed, you could then replace him with a with an ogre and stuff like that. <laughs> um, no, the bash area is getting nerfed to hell. Claws getting nerfed, piling on removed. So that that all there is gonna be is a uh, dirty player and sneaky git. So yeah, it's like good Nurgle, isn't it? That's like a good Nurgle start. Because uh, the Nurgle start is all the strong boys, and then one Pestigore, isn't it? Whereas these can start with all the strong boys and six pestigors, <laughs> essentially. Hey, he's only got two rerolls. He bought down on all balls and gets the AV break. Classic. Right. <laughs> So this one, obviously, we've got to reroll this if this is a both down. Okay, good. And I've got to blitz him to try and get forward. I'm going to go there. Not getting very far forward. <laughs> but, you know, a little bit. Can't do it, I've got no balls. Might as well re-roll there, got three. Claw's not really going to be good. Uh, I mean, like it's... <laughs> it's going to be... The, the problem with Claw is it's going to be so rubbish against Armour 8. Like, it's going to be... It's so bad against Armour 8. That's the problem with Claw. Which makes it not a very good skill choice. Now, obviously, against Armour 9, it is going to be good. And you are going to need it, because otherwise, AV9 is going to beat you up uh, with Chaos. But you probably just don't want to use Chaos, to be fair. Well, I was going to say, he couldn't, he couldn't accept the dub skulls there. He just couldn't. So that was nice. Three actions used and a reroll. Pretty good. Chaos in Blood Bowl 3 looks terrible, yeah, absolutely terrible. Unless there's no redrafts, right? If there's no redrafts, then then they're alright because they get the 3000 TV and do things. So, it's just weird. Yeah, but it's just hardly anything against Armour 8. It's, hard, it's, so, it's really, really bad against Armour 8. 
looked really bad. Like it, to the point where I don't think I'd take it on Skaven at all. Um, like for a double, I don't think I'd take Claw as a double. Put it that way. Oh yeah, they're a bit meh, but at least you could use them, couldn't you? Without a redraft. Do we blitz him there and then get forward here? Yeah. Just go there, in fact. Cheeky pushes here. Outrageous. Do I put him? You know, can I go up here? That seems a bit risky, doesn't it? But it could it could work. You put him there so you can't just blitz him and tag at the back. Double GFI? No, I've only got to use the room. Looks like he's going to pick off the back, I think. Or he's just going to get further ahead. So I guess getting forward is fine. If he, if he puts, if he bases the back, it's not a problem to clear, is it? So getting forward is better. Yeah, well, that's the thing, Wolfback. If you go high TV, having 35k followers is crap, isn't it? You want players that can do things, so... You'd rather have uh, other things. Yeah, but I mean, I'm looking forward to it, but that's only because we're so we're so far behind the times in Blood Bowl 2, aren't we? You know, like I think if we already had Blood Bowl 2016, I wouldn't really be looking forward to it very much. <laughs> <laughs> like it would be interesting the buying skills and stuff and it would be inter it would be a lot more trepidation to see if they fucked up seasons um uh, you know so like it would just be pure trepidation if, if we had blood bowl 2016 it would be it would just be trepidation um squirrel dude did all of the uh things uh cocky I'll show you. It's pinned in Blood Bowl, but I'll just link you it. There you go. Yeah, exactly. I'd be gutted about losing the D3 MVP if we'd already had that, so... You know, it's, uh... He is, yeah. Yeah, he is. We can burst through here, can't we? I believe. One, two, probably. One, two, three, four, five, six, and go there. Pretty ropey, to be fair. Uh, 
And the worst thing is having to do this geophyte to get out in front first. He can go up there, so and he's got a GFI to there. And he's got to go there first, hasn't he? Oh my god! <laughs> this is really looking disturbing. He can go there, so then these can go places. Alright, he can go. He doesn't need a GFI. That's nice. Le ballon est en sécurité. À l'autre équipe de prouver le contraire. GFI to get him on the right side. Turn, wasn't it? Couple of GFIs, a bit risque. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's definitely up there. I don't want to disrespect anyone else who's a who's a lovely admin and all around nice guy, but yeah, Skrull's certainly one of the best ones for sure. Yeah, close. Well, I mean, close treat everything as armor seven, but you can just choose not to use them against halflings. Also, the way it's worded means that you wouldn't anyway. But yeah, close do treat everything as armor seven, but you can't combine it with mighty blow to break armor, which is why it's really crap against armor eight. And it's it's still pretty decent with armor with with against armor nine, but against armor eight, it's just a bit crap. Oh man! And then he pushes him there, and then hits him. Oh, that was brilliant, wasn't it? Oh, that was that was pretty good play by him. Shit. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> and he did it without a reroll. I mean, okay, it was a frenzy trap and it was lucky, but still. Fuck. Oh man, you might just win here, mightn't he, if he does this pass now. He's not in range with him though. <laughs> oh, please fail. Please fail. Yes. <laughs> He's in the way of him though, still. So that's not even that bad. That's not even that bad for him. Got to blitz her and then push him to there and then go one, two, three, four, five, GFI, GFI. Ah, si 
ça continue, le syndicat va les blacklister. Le joueur a pris le ballon et la zone d'embut est tirée. Oh, and his KOs have stayed out. Lovely. Worked out well, didn't it? Got us a warrior. Got us a warrior touchdown instead of a instead of a beast man touchdown. <laughs> that was nice play by him, though. To be fair. Or again, it might have just been terrible by me to over, to like. It might have been a terrible oversight, but I still thought it was good by him. <laughs> what have I done with this lineman? Yeah, was a bit proud of this push. Yeah, so there you go. So it was probably a good spot by him. <laughs> Time to watch YouTube out of one turn with Dark Elves by Jimmy Fantastic. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah, good. Good. I don't feel so bad. Because it, you know, like, obviously after that, you're like, should I have spotted it? Or was, like, was it a good spot by him? Or was it an oversight by me? But I guess it could be both. Or it could just be really good by him. And not an oversight, I guess. I pushed him back, yeah, because I was thinking I would powered him. Was... <laughs> yeah, it was stupid, wasn't it? <laughs> I was thinking I'd, I, I was thinking I'd power him. Um, I was thinking when I power, I'll have to do an extra GFI, and then I just, I just did the wrong thing completely. Yeah, good point, Irish round. <laughs> yeah, once I'm gonna have to do the dodge anyway. Oh dear me. So that was definitely terrible. And that was definitely terrible. Well, the idea was to pow her and then not have to make the dodge, obviously. And then I just wasn't smart enough to realise that I hadn't powered her. <laughs> yeah, they do, don't they? I also could have probably just done like a hand pick up handoff, would have been probably safe, wouldn't it? Like I could, probably could have just taken the pat and then done a pick up handoff and then I couldn't have died on that. On the hand off fail. I don't know. Oh, Gloomin. <laughs> Tony. Is he gonna foul Tony? Oh no. Don't even think of it. He's fouling Tony. No. <laughs> no, he didn't. <laughs> Please don't come back. Yes! Zero percent effort, hundred percent dice, and just the way we like it. Glorious. Hello, Ansi. Yeah, um, I didn't feel like playing Blood Bowl, so went for the. Uh, Went for a new team of chaos. Um, Warriors is kind of good, isn't it? Because it forces him to commit to the LOS. He has got less players as well already. Got to play this hard, haven't we? Got to play hard D. <laughs> this drive. <laughs> Hard D should be a t good team name, actually, shouldn't it? Not gonna do anything clever on defense, just gonna hurt dirt base, base, base. <laughs> Got nine players, hasn't he? One reroll, it's just literally hurt, 
Herpening, derpening. Oh, he's got three rerolls now. Look a dog. I think that's so much better for him going from three to four than it is for me. Like, sorry, so much better for him going from two to three than it is for me going three to four. Phew. I probably should have put the one that scored not on the LOS. Yeah, good, he's not. Is this the one who scored? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, exactly, yeah. That's it. Isn't it? Two two is really is just super low. So he like he's gotta be so mean with his rerolls with only two. Like he doesn't have any freedom to try stuff. I've still got freedom to try stuff with three. So getting a fourth doesn't really change how I can play. Whereas him getting a third lets him try a lot of stuff that he just simply couldn't try if he had uh If he didn't have them. I don't want to go too far over here. Do here a little bit in case he wants to try to switch over there a little bit pretty mindless basing here <laughs> I've obviously got to be wary of the surf so I couldn't go full herp derp as I wanted to Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, but that's it. Truff and rage. I guess it's meant to be like truffy and rage, right? Not ragging. Rage. Yeah, that's it. Just I, I love going to three rerolls with dark elves. I, I I like three. I always go reroll. Like, you know, I'll <laughs> funnily enough, in in a uh, in naf style, I tend to prefer three rerolls to two rerolls in an apple and stuff. And I think three. Three, uh, three rerolls just gives you so much more freedom than two. And also the fact he's on offense, so like he's got to keep the ball safe and he has to use them to protect the ball. Yeah, pretty, pretty dis. I mean, okay, I've got no blocks, so like I'm gonna need more rerolls than him anyway. But it doesn't change. Like four rerolls just makes my normal play slightly more reliable, doesn't it? Like I had to eat that both down, which I wouldn't have done if I'd had four. But, and I would have eaten a thick pickup fail, which I wouldn't have done if I had four. But, um, yeah, four rerolls isn't going to change how I can play, but it is going to change how he can play. The good thing is, the Witch Elf's on the other side, so we're not in danger of getting surfed. Going up here. Realistically. And bring him back as a safety. Yeah. OK. 
Get an extra block here. Cheeky. Nice. Beautiful. Right, following there means that we don't get this extra block um, from not following, but it means he does get to come around here and shore up the sideline a bit. And he gets to blitz him. And re-roll it! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm so lucky! <laughs> Get up there! Um, right, he's going to go there to make the dodge out for these guys a bit harder. can still hit him. Oh, I play on Xbox. Oh, reroll was always going to cast, yeah. I mean, I would have probably rerolled that with three anyway. But still. <laughs> oh, Tom Schnitz. It's been lucky as well. Incredible luck, really. Incredible good luck, this. Yeah, it's pretty much your dicing, yeah. <laughs> yeah, breaking armor. <laughs> Abachi team breaking armor. <laughs> what sorcery is this? <laughs> and now it's looking real rough for him, isn't it? Because he ain't got dodge or anything. So, like, now all these rolls are terrifying. And okay, they might still work. But it's not. They're not good like they are at higher TV, are they? And not even higher TV, just like 1,100 or whatever. They just get a few dodge, they're so much better. And blodge and what have you. That's true, yeah. I mean, they're always dangerous, obviously, even with... Even even without uh, without dodge on them. And like, obviously, blodge elves, you can, you can get four dice on them and not knock them over very easily. It's very, so it, you know, it's very easy to get four dice on a dark, like on a blodger, and still not knock him over. Whereas when they don't have blodger, they're just so much worse. You roll the one. Yeah, yeah, he, he he totally outplayed me, and his reward was uh, a pointless GFI, a Chaos Warrior score, all his KOs roll. All of, his, all of his KO rolls failing <laughs> and then taking two more cards. <laughs> Absolutely brutal. There's no real way for him to get safe here, is it? I mean, he can actually, he can get this guy out and GFI with him and make a cage over here, but it's rough. That's his only chance. That get, no, yeah, that's his only chance. Had to put the ball to here. Witch Elf to there, Dark Elf Blitzer to there, and then this guy to here. Because this is not safe. Right. I've just moved him to there. Okay, he's still back here. Actually, he wants to shore this up, doesn't he? He wants to go on there. Right, trying to make it as... I don't really care about so, so much about the the uh, recovery because it's not likely anyway. It's more important to stop him catching a bouncing ball, isn't it? Really, so he's catching it on threes, 
and then four, so I've got to put an extra guy to make it five. And then sixes for the follow up. <laughs> Cocky! <laughs> yeah. yeah! That's probably it, yeah! Oh, bastard! Well, there you go, he catches out on a 5 plus anyway. He's still in a in a in a not fun place, isn't he? <laughs> like I'm definitely thinking more about how do I turn this into a two 0 than how do I not concede. The bread mass getting the touchdown and the cows. Depends, depends Robin, Robinho. He was a footballer, wasn't he? Um, depends on the, it depends on the team. Basically, depends on the team. There's certainly a, there's certainly a time and a place to do that. There's certainly a time and a place to keep him. Um, but without seeing like the whole team and that, can't really say one way or another. And there's no, there's no catch-all answer. Sometimes I would keep him, put him on the LOS until he died. Sometimes I would get rid of him. Just depends. I guess in CCL I'd, I'd err towards. But then it depends. Yeah, no, it depends. It depends. Without any other information, I'd err towards sacking him because then it improves your matchmaking in in CCL. But there's no, there's no right or wrong answer without seeing the rest of the team. And even then, who's to say who's right or wrong? <laughs> Ooh. Must be going to hand off to the witch elf here. He's rolled a one. So there you go, he'd be out of rerolls now, right? This would be devastating to him at this point, being out of rerolls. But instead, he's not out of rerolls. Interesting that he didn't put the witch like behind the screen. A witch drop. <laughs> he caught it again. This guy fucking loves the ball, doesn't he? Jesus. <laughs> this guy fucking loves the ball. Right. Three D. To uh, bracket this guy. And bracket this guy. And put him in there. And then go for the hit. Tony's gonna do it. For fuck's sake, Tony, don't be shit. Hey, he wasn't. Beautiful. Now he can go behind. 
I mean, you can probably just go here, right? I don't know. Try and pick it up. Don't re-roll it. Don't even need to. I probably should have added warrior left to pick up. Right, it's not bad though, is it? It was pretty safe. That was a pretty safe turn. Probably should have had a warrior back to pick up though. Maybe this guy... Maybe should have just based with a beastman there and then had the warrior free to pick up. <laughs> this you prick. <laughs> a sturdy ball sack. The ball sack in mode's amazing, isn't it? I wish I'd thought of that. So good. I even had the team admire my ball sack. Um, the no alert, sorry, twice hopped. Due to uh, due to fault force. Uh, due to fault force's many, many, many um, ludicrous donations of 25 cents to troll, I changed it to uh, 100 minimum. I do apologise. I might bring it down to 50. Yeah, okay, I'll bring it down to 50. I don't want to punish everybody for fault force. <laughs> Fuck you if I will TFORCE. <laughs> also, I was thinking of trying to get the uh, the English woman back because <laughs> she kind of say <laughs> fault force apparently. Yeah, <laughs> Oh dear me! Thank you very much. Oh, there's the pal, lovely. Um. <laughs> Yeah, well, I don't want to. I don't want to punish people, do I? Like, I don't know. I feel. I don't. I don't want to feel mean. Oh God, look at this! Look at this, elves! I should have picked up with a warrior, shouldn't I? That was my fault. That was my fault. Not picking up with a warrior. Got a GFI. Not with him. We can 2D there and then he doesn't need to. Oh man, he's passing everything. Okay, so this one's got a GFI there. Oh fuck off! <laughs> I mean, now he's just taking the piss. Didn't even need that last GFI but made it. Now he's got to reroll it because otherwise it's an easy 2D on the ball. I don't think he should have made that last GFI. I really should have picked up with a warrior though. I really should have left a warrior free for the pickup. That's my fault. I wanted to use strength four guys like, you know, as as pillars kind of thing. But realistically, I should have uh not. <laughs> should have had the strength four to recover. Yeah. My fault. Okay, so we're going to keep the warrior back last. Nice. Oh, fuck off. That was not the time to roll a double skull. So now I guess he's got to come in first. <laughs> Super. Does that even do anything? Not really. I guess I've got guys back. Ugh. At least he can't score this turn. <laughs> and he actually is out of rerolls now. Oi, 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 blimp on flu. <laughs> oh, 
the, at least he's out of rerolls. Everyone's based. No one's got dodge, apart from witch elf. So, like every roll he makes is scary, isn't it? But yeah, I really should have. I should have just. It's my fault, isn't it? I should have left a warrior to pick up. Stupid. Is this the one on five? No. Sadly, neither on. Oh, this could be a one in, one in nine could fail. One in nine could fail. So the one on five is in no position to do a pass or a touchdown or anything. something. <laughs> hey, good. Right, can I make it three dice? Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, okay. Can I make this one three dice? <laughs> That's a dodge. <laughs> so, no. That's a dodge. I'm fucking pissed off with this guy. Good job, made it three dice. <laughs> Warriors got it. Yes, Gary. Yes. Glorious. Wee wee wee. Alright, he's nearly in range. Punch him. Haha, <laughs> get the pow. I think get the foul on him. No, I've foul on him because he's closer and he's just a two plus away from doing something. Je crois ne va pas le Cheers, Cocky, see here. Ah, failed. GFI handoff. And he goes and passes it to him who scores. <laughs> it's uh <laughs> It's possible. Unlikely, but possible. Hey, you're all the way. Beautiful. GFI handoff pass. To him. Ça ressemble curieusement à un vieux spectacle traditionnel des familles. Ouais, je connais la tour. Right. Two, 
the three, four, five, and then a pass. Yeah. doing the fucking pass this turn is he <laughs> hello scuro um yeah it looks like it <laughs> i did out everybody in the disco Building a control chaos team, yeah, G two three, yeah, of course. Chaos, uh, control is the only kind of chaos team there is, isn't there? Obviously. <laughs> All right, so definite win anyway with that. Def or win. <laughs> because it's game one, Tom <laughs> It is game one. God, I love blue. I'm, actually, I prefer blue white control, but I like blue black control. I actually, like blue. I like blue black. I, I like Psychotog a lot. I remember the old blue black. I like blue Glorious. black splashing green. No, for the, I won't uh, give in until I'm victorious. Oh, brilliant! And I will defend. I will defend. Fuck <laughs> I should really cancel my fucking subscription. <laughs> I'm paying the of TZ fuck cycle. <laughs> Thank you very much for force. <laughs> um. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Right. <laughs> Let us go with the uh, 3D here. Into another 3D? No, we, we, we. Nothing. Have a good thing. <laughs> Have a fucking good evening and a wonderful life, you fucking treasure. Oh, that's brilliant. <laughs> what a lovely chap. I'll say you too, that's the least I can do, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, brilliant. What a lovely chat. <laughs> oh, said C note. Oh, no, demonetized. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Plim plum fuck. Oh, yeah, seventy k. Ten AV breaks to five. Forty blocks to thirty. I mean, got pretty lucky on the removals, to be fair. Which led to him having to make the desperation. He got pretty lucky on his desperation play, but he wouldn't have had to do the desperation play had he been a bit luckier before then. 14, 17, 26, so nice block dice. 24, 33, 33, great block dice as well. Lovely. Especially without any block. Well, think about what you've just said, Fort Force, and then work out the answer. <laughs> uh. 
Right. And the question is whether to go claw pom first. I'll just go block. Well, think about it. Think about it, Fall Force. And then work it out. <laughs> think about your question. And then work it out. Work out the answer. We'll work it out. Right, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.